Well, finally, just some cle some cleaning up. Um, adding a few pieces into our project will really make a, a big difference. First is I'm just going to add some basic CSS in addition to my bootstrap. Um, I'm going to make the background black. Um, text colors will be white and just making sure that everything um, everything else, the text is colored white. Now to include this in the base file, we just add an additional link that um, is also a style sheet we added after we have the URL to bootstrap and we use the template language to also inject the URL to that file called style.css that lives in that static folder. So again, this is an expected convention that we have a folder named static and then inside of that lives our CSS. So this is how we can access it. All right, that's in, in our base file. And with this, the, the only other things are to maybe change, you know, just go back and change some things about the map um, and maybe add a little bit of text that prefaces the table and the map. So that's all I've done here is go back and put a little header with a snippet on the table. This is the top 15 countries and a little header over the map, some information here. And we can color those headers also if we want, just using CSS in, um, in line. And now if we, I'm going to start my, save those changes, start my app back up, and let's see how this looks. Again, I should do something about making that map uh, a little bit more extensible. And here is what we end up with. Pretty, pretty good for um, less than an hour. You know, and we can click this and we find information about the different confirmed cases. So we can certainly go back and change things about our map but this is quite uh, quite a good start.